Thanks, guys. I'm Stephen Human. Now, oftentimes when you set out on a dirt road on an adventure, you kind of, you know, you have an idea of what to expect. And when I set out this morning, I thought that I had an idea of what I was going to find today. But if you look around me, I was dead wrong. So the plan was simple. Head into the West Desert of Utah on some of the old forgotten roads and just see what we can find. We came to the crossroads that lead to the small town of Calio, and since I'd been there before, we took the road south just to see where it went. Now at this point, we're about three hours outside of Tooele, Utah over the Pony Express route, so we are out here. The terrain is really surprising as you look out at the mountains on the Utah-Nevada border, but what we discovered in the incredibly small town of Gandhi took us completely off guard. This is Crystal Ball Cave, a rare find that reminds us that sometimes where we think there's nothing to see, we can discover hidden possibilities we'd never have dreamed possible. My uncle found Crystal Ball Cave in 1956. He had a little bunch of sheep and he lived here where I live and the sheep went up on the mountain and he went up looking for them and found the cave. Gerald Bates, who runs the Bates Ranch in Gandy, takes tour groups through the cave on a regular basis. The cave is on BLM land and he has become the official steward of this amazing place. The first thing you notice upon entering is that this is unlike any other subterranean environment you've ever seen, where most caves have a sort of pointed angularness about them due to stalactites and tight corners. Crystal Ball, in contrast, feels almost soft. It still has some of the classic cave features, but most of it is more rounded than you would ever expect. There's about a foot of calcite crystal on everything you look at in there. The cave was completely filled with water form calcite crystals on the big boulders, on the walls, on the ceiling, every place. So if you put a light on that, it'll just uh, illuminate out. And it's the only cave with that much calcite crystal. It was the largest known body of the calcite crystal in the world. It was pretty amazing to climb up a small little mountain and then enter a metal door and be just introduced to this amazing cave that you would never thought would existed way out here. A mixture between popcorn everywhere and then marshmallows but just these amazing kind of stalactites and that would come up and down from the ceiling and just a really amazing experience. And there are other unique features about the cave that will really raise your eyebrows particularly the musical quality of some of the formations. Okay listen to this I don't know if you can hear it. Can you hear that? That's just playing that note right off of this stalagmite. The funny thing is that Crystal Ball Cave is so unnaturally perfect, even Hollywood was taken aback. One studio came out here to tour the cave for a potential movie shoot and decided the cavern looked too amazing to be real. They was going to have these kids find a, an old Spanish treasure in a cave, and they came out and looked at the cave and they said it looked too artificial. But there's nothing artificial about this area, except for the tropical fish Gerald breeds and sells. Those definitely didn't originate here. Other than that, though, every turn introduces you to something new. Outside the cave, different adventures are literally on the doorstep. From Granite Canyon just to the north and the OHV trails that head into surprisingly fertile and beautiful lands, to springs that flow out of the rocks and then disappear into crevices just a few meters away. There's even a slot canyon just a mile from Gerald's Ranch that was carved by flash floods like its southern Utah counterparts, but it's cut through granite instead of sandstone gray instead of red. It's amazing what you can find when you climb in your 4x4 on an old dusty road in the west deserts of Utah. Now getting out here is pretty easy with a map since you want to make sure you're on the right dirt road and we actually have the route we took on the AYL website for you to check out. It's a long way so be prepared because you won't find a Walmart out here. Bring extra water, food and even gas just to be safe. Your experience will be more stress-free if you do. Now, if you want to come out and camp at the Bates Ranch, it's a great spot, and Gerald will give tours of the cave once you've set up an appointment. While he doesn't charge for tours, tips are generously accepted, since he's pretty much single-handedly keeping the cave open to the public. You can call to set up tours at 435-693-3145. This was an incredibly surprising day, and the best part is that we only scratched the surface of what you can find out here. You need to get off the beaten path and explore somewhere new. Just imagine the stories you'll be able to tell once you come back to civilization after finding something amazing in the wilds of the West. Oh my gosh, gonna go into work tomorrow and be like, I just went to the craziest place on earth and I didn't think I'd end up there. It's not like entering any commercial cave. 
it's just like you almost feel like you're the first person here. Sacred is the, the wrong word, but it's just a more unique and special place than any other trashed out cave in the U.S. Well, for At Your Leisure, I'm Stephen Human. We need to take a commercial break, but we'll be back with this week's Prime Review. Hey guys, if you like that video, you're gonna to wanna to watch all of our other AYL videos. You're gonna to wanna to like it, you're gonna to wanna to share it, and you're gonna to wanna to subscribe, right? See all the buttons right here? <laughs> this is what you're gonna to wanna to do, click, right? Click, click, click. on them, because we have some really cool videos, all kinds of behind the scenes stuff, bloopers of Alicia crashing and stuff. Why are you gonna sell me out like that, Steven? <laughs> so you wanna click all of these things and subscribe to our channel, because At Your Leisure is awesome, and uh, we'll see you here for more videos.